Before we get into today's video, PG Squad, do not forget to slap that like button. Also, hit subscribe to officially join the PG Squad. I mean, you might want to check it out. If that button's red, go ahead, make it white. Visit SafePG.shop to get your hands on official PG Squad merch today. Hey, what is up, you guys? It's Megan, and welcome back to my channel, PG Squad. Today, we are back with some more Adopt Me Ticks. T ticks, tips, tricks, hacks, whatever you guys want to call them. And wow, guys, there are some new interesting things circulating the TikTok market. So today I thought that we would take a look at some of them and see if we could make it happen. Let's get into it. So I haven't played Adopt Me literally all weekend because I, I took the weekend off, but I was able to log in. Ooh, and get my login day streak. Yes, okay, perfect. Day 197. So we are getting so close, still pretty far away from getting our golden egg. Comment down below right now your login day streak. I really want to know. So guys, I'm not gonna waste a ton of time. The first thing I want to show you guys is something really cool I found that I think I've never noticed before. I don't know if anybody else has ever pointed this out, but this is not a TikTok hack. I just found this out literally today. This big mountain right here, you can literally hide inside of it and you can spy on people. I want to do this at the end of the video, so stay tuned to see what happens. Let's let's go ahead and get out of the big rock because I don't know, that's just so weird, don't you think? You know what? No problem. So let's pull up our very first TikTok hack so this looks like kind of like a glitching duplication hack it's not a real pet duplication hack but it should like kind of spawn two of your unicorns and then like one would be in place see she has two unicorns there they're kind of stuck in place so i want to give this a try asap first things first though i think we have to go in our house to do this glitch because you're gonna want it to be in a spot where um you know you're reloading so like we're if we're like reloading here and we open up like let's Let's pull up a unicorn right here. So they were clicking really fast like this and then they clicked reset, reset. Oh my gosh, wait, I have to get faster at that. So they were clicking really fast. And they clicked reset, reset, yes. Ah, and then they were still clicking really fast. So you actually have to get pretty fast at this, I feel like too. Oh my gosh, how does anybody do this? Okay, so <laughs> did we, did it work? No, <laughs> it literally did not work. Okay, hold on. So let's see if we can get this. So let's let's try with our Mega Neon Unicorn. Cause then we would have two, right? So you're gonna click like escape R enter. Escape R enter. <laughs> escape R enter. I don't know, how do I know if I get two of them? How do I know? Okay, that's not working. How long do I try this before I give up? You know, escape R enter. It, no. <laughs> is this working? I don't think this is working. I don't know, guys. Oh, I missed a beat. Okay, so no way. I can't get this to work, guys. Can you get this to work? She, like, was opening it up really fast like this. She would escape, reset really fast, and then keep on trying to open, escape, reset really fast, and then she should have two. But I don't know. Am I doing this wrong? Comment down below what you guys think. Let's just move on to the next hack because I cannot get this to work. So this next hack is more of a little build hack that I think is really cute. Basically, you just put apples inside the food bowl and it allows your or animal to eat apples or normal food. I really like this. I'm gonna try it. So let's go ahead and get ourselves a bowl like this, a pet food bowl. And then let's put like, she put apples, right? And she put them in like this. I think like you can, how do you turn the grid off? Oh, right here. Small, you make it small and then you can move things. Very handy. If you guys didn't know, that's how you do it. You change the grid size to small and then your little unicorn can eat like a bunch of apples. It's just really cute. Okay, so that's looking really good. I think I'm gonna put this one in a little bit more. So it kind of looks like a bowl of tomatoes, but you know, I'd eat it. Maybe not if it's tomatoes. Let's try one with bread too. Um, Like these decorative breads. Like if we can hide the bowl like this with a piece of bread, kind of like this, like maybe it's like two loaves of bread. Or, okay, let's try something. Let's get a brick like this and see if we can just hide the bowl. Oh, but that's way bigger than the piece of bread. Then if you put the bread on top of the brick, maybe make the brick like a different color. Let's see what this looks like. Okay, so of course we can have her eat here. Oh, and then, yeah, that, that's working out really well. And hey, look at that, guys. She's hungry. She's kind of phasing into the this area, but you know what? That's fine. How do I get to the other one I, the other one I made like this? Oh no, that's not working. So maybe I covered it, a oh wait, yeah. 
No, that's not looking very good. That's looking really ridiculous. Oopsies, I'm so sorry. Let's take a look at the next hack, you guys. How to make your pet neon quicker. So this is gonna be a challenge. So go to the sky castle, tap on the diamond. Whoa, 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 hold on. Back it up, back it up, lady. Tap on the diamond at the top of the sky castle three times. Very specific. Um, that was more than, she was tapping more than three times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 10, 11, 12. She like tapped 12 times. And then she gets a golden apple and then you feed that to your pet. And then your pet will like just run into the castle itself. And then it will turn neon. Sounds like a bunch of baloney to me. But you know, that's what we're here for. To try new and exciting things. So what pet do we want to try to turn neon on a whim? So let's let's see. We have a few unicorns here, but you know, I've always wanted a neon giraffe. So let's just get on spots here. Let's fly him to the top of the sky castle where I will continue to press the diamond three times. Not 12 like in the video, but three, because that's what she said. So we just gotta fly all the way up. I just, I'm not believing this at all. And I know maybe you know, if that girl sees this, she'll be like, oh, well, you have to, it has to be in the daytime. Mm, you know what? So we're just gonna try this <laughs> anyway, even though it's night. All right, spot. So let's go up here. Takes a little bit of time to get up here. And then I guess you just start clicking on it. Oh, wait. Oh, I think I clicked more than three times. This isn't even anything you could click on. This is so funny. One, two, three. And then we should have a golden apple. No luck. No golden apple. So that's already flawed. I'll go get a golden apple, okay? Ah! Okay, good thing I'm at the hospital. So if you guys didn't know, the golden apples are in the hospital, right in here. You use them whenever your pet is feeling sick and then it'll make them not sick anymore. So they're really handy to carry around if you're grinding pet levels and you don't wanna keep on running back to the hospital. So we'll get one, here it is. Let's go back to the exact same spot where she said this hack was going to work. <sighs> Okay, we'll just we'll just keep on going. I just don't think that this is true. Not like of course nothing is going to happen. But I want to know if you guys can make it happen. So let's uh let's click 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 three times. Maybe we gotta get closer just in case. Oh daytime. Okay, so now this experiment should be fully going. Okay, so one two three. You know one two three. Clicked it and then let's go down here. This might have been where she is. Might have not been. Maybe she's supposed to be on the other side. Let's stop the ride. And then we're gonna get the food and we're gonna feed him this apple. And then after this apple, he should just run into the castle. It said, follow your pet into the castle. So I'm expecting him to run into the castle any moment now. Absolutely any moment now. Okay, he's not running. So let's just pick him up and take him inside the castle then. And we will set him down. That didn't work. So I guess we're just gonna have to level them the old fashioned way. We'll bungee jump down, you know, so that nobody gets hurt. How do I get off of the bungee jump? Hello? Hello? Um, please let me go. If I fly all the way over here, am I gonna snap back? Zoinks! Oh my gosh, I was literally just launched. Spots, are you okay? So Spots has a lot of needs going on, so I'm gonna fulfill a little of these real quick. Just because, you know, when your pet needs to be taken care of, you take advantage of that to get the XP. You don't ask questions, you just do it. So while Spots enjoys the cool pool party, I'm gonna bring up our next hack. Okay, so in this hack is this point of view, you're back in time to the old Adopt Me. Now, this is really interesting. Oh, it's like credit Kristen. So this might actually be Kristen's video and they filmed it. Okay, guys, so this is really cool and you guys definitely wanna know about this. So, I have some news, guys. It's not super big news. Basically, I was talking to the brand new manager of Adopt Me, the new community manager, the, sorry, the influencer manager of Adopt Me, and I asked him if there was any way I could get on the 2017 beta server in Adopt Me. This is a true story, okay? Because basically I saw Kristen Place, my very, very, very good friend, make a video where she went back in time into a dummy, so I wanted to do that too. So look at this. How does one get access to this server? I sent it, he said, hey, let me check. He said, no current access. I said, okay, I wanted to make a video on it. I just didn't know if I could get on. And then he said he'd send the message through and then good news, it's public. Well, open now. This is on 522. So I was planning on making a little flashback video, a little Oh, back in the day adopt me video inspired by Kristen Place. But um, everybody made that video before me while my sister was in town. So I didn't get to, I, I was late and I, I decided not to make that video because whenever you're last to something, it's just like, the way you get onto that server is right here. You are in the Dreamcraft group, I am assuming. And once you're in that group, you should be able to see Legacy Adopt Me 2017, which is open to play right now because I asked them to reopen it. So if you've been playing, 
You're very welcome. Sometimes you just gotta ask for the things you want and not be afraid because the worst that people can say is no. So anyway, this is so fun. It's the old 2017 Adopt Me and it's a little blast from the past. So if you're interested in playing old Adopt Me, now you guys know. See, Pet Store coming soon. We got 10 bucks. We got all the stuff. Baby Shop. Oh my gosh, we can check out the very first babies. Okay, I feel like I actually remember this. I definitely remember this. Like the baby formula that they sold. That's so cute. But guys, that's how you get on the old Adopt me 2017 server. I'm not gonna make a whole video on it. Kristen Plays has one. I think now she has three. So definitely check that out if you're interested in a tour. How does one get away? Help! I'm stuck. I'm glitched into the unknown. I am in between. It's like a secret spot, guys. Ooh, and it's pink though, so maybe I can just hang out here for a bit. Guys, before we get going, I wanted to tell you guys about something that I am very, very excited about. As you guys noticed, I have a brand new fit on. We have the peachy t-shirt and a little skirt. Now this peachy t-shirt is actually based on a shirt that I designed all by myself and that I am making a real life shirt and it's going to be available mid-summer. Here is that, you can kind of see here. This is like the only place I've teased this shirt yet. But I went ahead and I commissioned this shirt a lot along with many others for my brand new summer 2020 digital collection. I call it my digital collection because as some of you guys know, I have a big merch collection drop coming soon. There's gonna be backpacks, lunch boxes, water bottles, three new plushies, a t-shirt, a hoodie, and probably some other stuff. Anyways, guys, check this out. This is my brand new merch collection. Of course, you can get to it by joining my group, hashtag Peachy Squad, and it is in the pinned comment down below. And you guys can just shop your little heart out. Make sure you get both of the sections, like the sleeves and the, and the body they're like sold separately so it's all linked together it's all super easy to find if you guys are interested it is just linked in the pinned comment so guys thank you so much for watching today's video if you enjoyed it don't forget to hit the like button subscribe button leave a comment down below also if you enjoyed this video you might enjoy some of the ones floating up beside my head including the bff squad video that one's there super fun love that channel and i would love if you guys would at least check it out Thank you guys so much for watching. Do not forget to hashtag stay PG, stay kind, use code MEGANPLAYS when purchasing Robux, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye!